Uh, hello friends, it is uh, second part of uh, today's video uh, about uh, more than two weeks of uh, Ukrainian-Russian war. Uh, as I told you that uh, uh, now uh, Russian army stopped, uh, they do not capture much uh, new territories and the army uh, destroyed, uh, all their attacks uh, um, destroyed uh, and even division uh, destroyed uh, for these days, um, so they have problems with uh, with people, and uh, Putin search for you know uh, for someone who will you know join him. Today, uh, Lukashenko, the president of Belarus, uh, will come to uh, Putin, and uh, there will be uh, uh, their meeting. And actually, uh, today Belarus is involved in this conflict because uh, from the territory of Belarus. These all missiles and uh, bombers, they, uh, they, uh, they, they from the territory of Bel Belarus fly uh, on our cities. So uh, Putin uh, used the territory of Belarus, but uh, Russian, uh, sorry, Belarusian army is still not involved. And uh, as Putin has no soldiers now, he tried to, uh, everyone think that he will try today Lukashenko. Um, to uh, make him involve his army in this conflict. And uh, Lukashenko tried to not do that by all means, because he afraid of his own army. Um, as you know, uh, two years or a year ago, uh, uh, he, uh, it was uh, elections and he lost it. Uh, and uh, to, to stay president, he uh, beat his own uh, people and uh, police was very cruel there uh, and uh, so um, so belarus people they hate hate their own president lukashenko because he is not a truly president truly leader and so he afraid to involve his army in this conflict because uh, because this army actually may join ukrainian army and try to eliminate him uh, so, and actually Belarus people, they are not motivated, they are even less motivated than Russian soldiers, because Russian, so, Russian um, I think, state is more like aggressive, uh, they like to capture new territories, new uh, people, and um, they, there is some, uh, you know, some feature of this character in Russian have, Rus Russian people have, but uh, Belarus people, they, uh, they never make, may, made wars before, uh, they are very peaceful and actually um, all know that uh, uh, Russian and Ukrainian people, they are like brothers, they are very close to each other, our uh, language is very, very similar and if you know about uh, such a country like Slovakia and Czech Republic, you know that these two countries they are very close to each other. They have very good relationships and they have similar languages. And actually, um, they they uh, like you know like uh, almost twins. Uh, and uh, Ukraine and Belarus are the same. So you understand uh, what will be uh, 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 what what will think uh, Belarusian. Uh, people and Belarusian soldiers about war with Ukraine, uh, even not for Lukashenko, which uh, they hate, uh, but even for president of other country, Putin. Of course, there is a lot of propaganda of Belarusian TV too, but you know that uh, these good relationships for uh, centuries, uh, they stayed and people still uh, know that Ukrainian people are their brothers and Mm, this ar ar army will be more motivated to eliminate Lukashenko than to uh, make war with uh, Ukrainians. Uh, but anyway, uh, today this will be this meeting Lukashenko and Putin, and everyone thinks that uh, Putin will push and try to make Lukashenko involve his army in this conflict and uh, attack Ukrainian uh, Ukraine from the western north. Um, because uh, Putin have no any success uh, and they have a lack of caliber missiles, as I said. A uh, few days before um, they made bombardments of Vinica. It is uh, um, 
thousand western city and uh, they destroyed that place like airport where uh, military planes uh, or it, it was even not military but civil civilian airport and they used eight uh, caliber type uh, missiles and uh, there was information that Putin was shocked and he was very angry with uh, the, his uh, generals because uh, they used this very expensive um, expensive uh, missiles and they have uh, no not much of them they uh, only iskanders left um, and they are not powerful uh, they are not uh, uh, precise you know uh, to in 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 this uh, to hit some precise uh, targets they are not that good in this and uh, so um, now uh, that is uh, what, the, the, what kind of news we have. Um, and actually, I think uh, what what I may tell you more. Well, what about m maybe Pridnistrovia? You know, it is also captured by um, um, part of Moldova. Um, and it is on, on the south, uh, western south of Ukraine. And actually it is the same like DNR, LNR, but in Moldova, and it was captured uh, years before. Um, there's also uh, Russian uh, military forces, um, and um, a lot of experts um, uh, think if uh, they can be used to, to attack Ukraine, but uh, I understood that uh, th there is not enough, they are very weak, um, for this, um, also important you that uh, on Russian TV there there was some messages and uh, news like about fake news, of course, that um, uh, Ukrainians in their labs create uh, bacteriological, biological, and uh, chemical weapon, and now a lot of military experts are afraid that uh, the TV uh, was uh, told uh, this thing that. Uh, uh, Russia want to apply in Ukraine chemical weapon uh, in Mariupol, in Kiev, for example. And it is a terrible thing. I hope uh, they will not do that. But a lot of experts say that Putin may do this, may do this, uh, you know, criminal step because he sees that his army lost. He cannot do anything and he cannot stay back. He should do some something. And he cannot capture Ukraine by using his soldiers, so he may apply this chemical, bacteriological weapon. And it, actually, it's uh, pure genocide. Uh, it's pure uh, destroy. Uh, just they, he want to destroy Ukrainian people. You know, this pregnant woman, kids, uh, civilian people. So I think uh, <laughs> we should stop Putin actually by any means because he is not a human anymore. He is a beast. Uh, because he was too uh, long in his chair of president. Thank you for watching. Uh, bye.